To demonstrate, I have here a RuleMate 800 gallon per hour automatic bilge pump. As the water level in your bilge increases, the pump activates. After the water level goes down and the pump switches off, residual water in the hose line drains down back through the system. Some of the water catches in dips or sags in the pipework, trapping air between these bends and the underside of the pump. When the bilge refills with water and the pump starts again, the trapped air keeps the impeller from making contact with the water so that it is not able to move the water up and out. The motor continues to run, but no water is being discharged. This may lead to overheating, which can cause major damage and ultimately early pump failure. Now let's try the same simulation with the Sahara MK2. As the water level in your bilge increases, Atwood's steady switch turns the pump on. The water level recedes, steady switch returns to its rest position, and the pump turns off. Same as with the RuleMate, residual water drains down back through the system and pools in the use in the piping. But rather than stay blocked, Sahara MK2 eliminates the airlocks and resumes water flow. The difference is Atwood's patented X-Air impeller. It is specifically designed to force air bubbles trapped in the hose and underside of the pump out of the pipework so that the pump will not run dry and burn out. Sahara MK2 also comes equipped with a non-return valve in the outlet. This check valve helps prevent the water from backflowing through the pump.